Hey guys, my name is Dan, I'm a veterinarian, and there is a pill coming that you can treat your cat's diabetes with. Alonka was done it again, they have presented Bexacat, which is a medication you give to your cat orally or by their mouth, and this could help treat and manage their diabetes. It's slotted or projected to come out in the spring of 2023, so we are rounding that corner, and this could definitely revolutionize how we treat cats with diabetes, because right now we are giving insulin injections once, twice a day, we're changing foods, and it is really a challenge for some pet parents because cats don't like to get poked with a needle. Elanco came out in December saying that they had FDA approval of this medication and they're going to name it Bexicat. Let's dive into this and I'm going to tell you what's happening and how this works. What Bexicat is, it's a sodium glucose co-transporter 2 inhibitor. What this is, guys, is about 90% of the glucose is recollected into the body during the proximal tubules of the kidneys. So think, just think of it simply, the kidneys, and they recollect glucose and put it back in the system. If you have a diabetic cat and the glucose is really high, you don't need that. So what Bexcat is doing is it's inhibiting the sodium glucose when sodium and glucose both re-enter the cell together and it, that is a co-transport. They come together. They're co-together. And that's, that's number two because the two or the second uh, transporter, by definition, that one actually brings in like 90% of the glucose back into the body. So it's just flooding in the glucose back in. And you're going to notice here that there's another transporter that gets it back into the body after it moves into the cells. What we're doing here is we're blocking this and allowing the glucose to continue through the kidneys. If this was helpful, please like and share and subscribe. I would appreciate it greatly. And you know what? All those things are free. And a bunch of people made comments about it saying how great it is. Like Dr. Catherine over at Purdue said this, I believe that Bexicat will be the game changer for the management of cats newly diagnosed with diabetes. The goal is to stabilize the glycemic index. And they did a field study, and they found that at 56 days out, 83% of the cats were regulated, had a regulated glycemic index, meaning their blood glucose was quite good, which is insane, because anyone that works in the veterinary world knows how incredibly hard it is to control diabetes in a cat. And this, this could make a lot of kitties' lives significantly better. And then Dr. Michael, the senior director at the U.S. Pet Health Consulting Veterinarians, he threw in, and I think this is really true, guys, um, Bexicat integrates seamlessly into the busy lifestyle of pet owners and provides a needle-free approach to managing diabetes in cats, which is so true. It's so hard to manage a cat with diabetes by poking them and checking blood glucoses, and it can just be really painful for the cat and really emotionally draining for the pet parent. Of course, guys, always talk to your veterinarian first before studying any medicine, get a diagnosis, and then go over a treatment plan on how to manage it. I have been looking at this quite a bit, and it looks like that only cats that are diabetic but overall healthy should be getting this. And it's really going to depend on if, it, if your cat has the right diabetes to be treated by Bexacat. Also, guys, um, if your cat has already been treated with insulin, um, that's one of those situations where I haven't read anything that encourages to stop the insulin and start the Bexacat. It sounds like before you do anything, assess the diabetes, see if Bexacat is appropriate for your cat, and then consider treating before doing any injections. Again, your veterinarian will be knowledgeable in this area. They can help guide you and give you direction. And uh, hopefully, hopefully this is a, a game changer for our kitties with diabetes and also a game changer for you guys because it is incredibly hard to give insulin on a twice a day basis and to provide a happier, healthy cat long term. Hi right, guys, hope it was crazy helpful. Again, my name is Dan. I'm a veterinarian. 